Thank you for joining me. Today we're going to take a look at writing a very simple Yara signature. I'm on the Yara website and as you can see here Yara is a tool aimed for doing fast pattern matching to identify or to classify malware into malware families. I'm going to open up a <clears throat> threat advisory that describes a cyber attacker. Here we have information around the Adwin rat. I'm going to go ahead and copy the MD5 checksum, and you'll need access to virus total. But we'll search virus total for that MD5 checksum, and we got a match. We'll go over to content, then strings, and see if there's any unique strings that would be unlikely to show up in other programs. Here we have the load stub Adwin, named after the rat. Further down, we have more unique strings. I'm going to go ahead and copy those strings and start to begin building our YAR signature. In the metadata field, I'm going to give some context behind this signature. I'm going to say who wrote it and who they can come to if they have any questions. Let's add a description as well. And we can also uh, give a reference as to where we found information about this. These are all great practices. The last one uh, that we're going to add is what sample we built our reference out of. So people later can come and understand that. All right. So in the string section, I'm going to go ahead and start adding the unique strings that we saw on the virus total website. For this example, we'll add just three. In the string section, the A, B, or C are variables that will come into play when we write our condition. Right now, we do not have very complex strings that we're matching against. So our condition, we're going to say, is all of them. Go ahead and save that. And now we can test our signature against the malware sample. Look, it hits. Let's go ahead and create it so that it won't hit and you'll see uh, what is happening. We'll run this again. It doesn't hit. Let's go ahead and change that back. Save it. And it works again. That concludes our uh, tutorial on writing your first YAR signature. Thanks for joining me and please let me know if you have any questions or comments.